protecting children, protecting our families, protecting our communities. It's why we carry a firearm. It's why we fight for our Second Amendment rights. And it's why I am so concerned about the Virginia governor's latest move. He's speaking out against Lee County's vote to arm teachers. The governor says he is even going to have Virginia's attorney general look into it to see if it's even legal. The Washington Post headline on the story reads, Virginia governor assails school system's plan to arm teachers. I want you to hear what the leader of the school board told his local TV station, WJHL. Somebody comes in a school with a gun, what do you do to stop it? Money can't stop it. Talking to them isn't going to stop it. That's the only option. Local leaders say they can't afford the solution the state wants. Hiring resource officers, arming teachers who want to protect their students is the solution they landed on. Now the governor of Virginia, Ralph Northam, is a Democrat. I could have predicted this move against arming teachers by him and other left-wingers, teachers who want to be able to protect themselves. Northam has taken big money from anti-gun groups like every town for gun safety. This is very typical of what's been going on across the country when it comes to Democrats in positions of leadership, disarming good people, and in turn, putting everyone around them in danger. 